Hello friends, welcome to Civil Engineering Exam. Today we are going to see the problem related with uh, water resource engineering in the topic of water demands that is population forecasting. So the problem is the population of 5 decades from 1930 to 1970 are given. Find out the population after 1 decade, 2 decade and 3 decades beyond the last known decade that is last uh, known decade is 1970 by the automatic increase method. So there are a lot of methods available for uh, find out the population forecasting. So that is uh, automatic increase method, then geometric method, uh, then uh, incremental increase method, decremental increase method. So a uh, lot of methods are there. So from that uh, we are using automatic increase method. Okay. So the year is given 1930. The corresponding population is 25,000. So then uh, year of uh, 1940, the corresponding population is 28,000. Then uh, at the year of 1950, the po population is 34,000. Then 1960, the population is 42,000. Then 1970, the population is 47,000. Okay. So from that, we have to find out after three decades, that is 1980, then 1990, then 2000. Okay, so for, for those years, what is the population? So we have to find out. So for that, we are using the formula P n equal to P naught plus n into x bar. Okay, so now n is number of decades. P naught is a lost uh, decade, uh, lost decade uh, population. Then x bar is average increase per decade. So average increase population per decade. So in the average increase per population, we can find out using increase in population uh, for every years. Okay, so now the solution we can take the three table columns. So there is year. So then population. So then increase in population. So increase in population x. Okay. So from that we can find out the x bar. Okay. So now we can take the years 1930, then 1940, then 1950, 1960, 1970. So the corresponding population is 25,000 then 28,000 so then uh, 34,000 so then 42,000 so then 47,000 okay so now we can take the difference between those things so whenever the population is increased we can take positive value so whenever the population decrease so we can take the minus value so now uh, the population is increased is uh, 3,000 so here the population is increased plus 6000. So then here the population is increased as uh, 8000. So here the population is increased 5000. Okay. So now we can add all those things. So we got the value of 22000. So uh, we can divide by 4. Okay, so there are four decades are there. So the x bar equal to 22,000 divided by 4. So now x bar value is 5,500. Okay, so the average increase in population is uh, 5,500. Okay, so now we can uh, substitute all the values. So now we can take P n equal to P naught plus n into x bar. So now we can take P1. That is the next, de next decade after 1970. So that is uh, 1980. That is population of 1980. Okay. So equal to. So the P naught value is 47,000. Plus N value is 1 into. So the X bar value is 5,500. Okay. So solving this we got the value of. P 1980 that is P 1 equal to so the value will be 52,500 okay so for 1980 the population forecasting is 52,500 okay likewise we can take uh, after three two decades so the P 2 1990 so that is P 1990 so now we can take uh, the value is uh, again 4700 plus so 00 plus 2 so there are 2 decades into 5500 
okay so now uh, we can solve this uh, we got the value of 58000 okay so 58000 is the answer so next we can take the third decade that is 2000 at the year of 2000 p2000 equal to so is again 4000 sorry 47000 plus 3 into 5500 Okay, so solving this, we got the value of sixty-three thousand five hundred. Okay, so at the year of two thousand, the population will be sixty-three thousand five hundred. Okay, so likewise, we can uh, calculate in every years and every decades. So this is a method we can solve the problem. Again, we will see next video. Thank you.